Hey folks, Species 7 here, and welcome back to the channel. Thanks for joining me on the Maypole Farm for Farm Sim 22. Did. This was just a rolling mud ball, so I figured we'd give her a bit of a scrub. Uh, tractor looks good. Okay. Anyways, we have uh, things to do. Hope everybody's doing well. It is early on a Sunday morning here on the beautiful sunshine coast of BC. And she's a chilly one. It's currently only 6 degrees. So, yeah. Not sure why it got so cold last night, but uh, it did. And now at 7.30 in the morning, it's still pretty, pretty chilly. Went for my walk this morning and I was like, oh, you're being a wimp today, man. It ain't that cold. Turns out, yeah, it was. Okay, that's a way. Now, first thing I want to do... Well... <laughs> I've fallen out of me tractor. Yikes. <laughs> oh, that's a good way to start your day. Go to back up and just fall right out of your machine. There we go. So I want to have a waddle over to the silo and see just what we've got for stored crops. We need to seed some fields, but in all honesty, I'm not sure what we want to seed them with. Not wheat, we've got a lot. Oats, we've got a lot. A lot of everything. Canola. Yeah, we could do with canola. It sells well and we don't have a lot of it. Alright, good, good. However, that is, yeah, it's still early enough in the morning. Let's see if we can, here you are. Oh, you're here. I didn't expect you to be here. Hmm. I didn't indeed. All right, you guys are fine. You guys are fine, because we just talked you up. Okay, this is an entirely the wrong farm. Uh, you're still good. You're still good. Whoa, what? Zero? What? How do we get to zero food? Oh, no. Um, yikes. How the heck did that happen? Well, I'm freaking now. <laughs> Sorry if I went quiet. I'm just trying to figure out how the heck. I mean, I check those just about every episode. I go through all of the animals. Oh boy, I hope there's something in here. Keep going. So hope everybody is well, having yourselves a nice weekend, and a nice summer, of course. So far it's been uh, quite a dandy little one here. We've had a little bit of rain over the last few days, but then boy oh boy did we need it. Half the province is on fire and the other half is waiting. So. Alright, let's go and get those poor girls fed. Oh man. I am such a bad farmer. Here I'm all worried about what we can do to throw some seeds in the ground, make a bunch more money, and uh, yeah. Meanwhile my cows are going, uh, how come he doesn't feed us? That's just terrible. 
Although, to be fair, I mean, the whole reason I was down at that other tractor was because I want to feed the, uh, load up the cow bins over at the, uh, the doggo farm. I mean, they've got a, but they've got a fair bit of food in there troughs already so it wasn't like a panic or is this oh yes this is very much like a panic so so big shout out all my regular viewers and uh, anyone new to the channel if you like the content you know maybe consider subscribing i do a fair bit of different content on the channel I usually try to upload at least a couple videos a day so uh you don't want to subscribe maybe at least hit that like button now before we all get happy happy joy joy here let's uh let's change our tip side to the right there we go Good thing they got a big grass field out there. Because I guess that's all they've been eating for a, a day or two. I'm sorry, ladies. That's just... Inexcusable farm behavior, that is. Absolutely inexcusable. Look at them, no doubt, eh? Oh, I feel bad. I really do. That was just rude. Okay, let's um, let's go deal with the other ones before they have the same issue. is for the tractor or the trailer. I don't think I've done anything to that trailer since we bought it. Where's the oil output doing? Yeah, here I was all bragging it up. We should buy a bunch more chickens and get those coops filled up. And I don't even uh, keep our cows fed. Okay.
the doggo farm. Ooh, that's a loud one. Oh, it ain't much better in here. Wow. Look at the tack, we're just redlining. <laughs> no, they got to blow me up. No, it just keeps it there. Even on level ground, it still keeps the tack in the red. Wow. Looks like it needs another year or something. see a crow crawling up the back wall. I am weirded out and getting out of there. Okay, what do we need here? Hopefully not that. Um, silage, that was it. We're down to just dribbles of silage. So, I haven't sorted these yet, but we have them. So, let's Raise the boingy thing there. Oh, that's certainly not the uh, thank you. Oh, these are uh, silage, aren't they? They're not just. No, they're still fermenting. Oh, crap. Do I have any... new? No. Um... Hmm. Are you missing anything else while I'm here? Like... Not really, eh? Everything else is like... Quintuple numbers. Well, other than the mineral feed, but... Oh, man. Hmm. Okay, well, you know, best laid plans and all that. I mean, it's not... Ow, scraped my shin. It's not the end of the world. Seems to me we started the episode like this, didn't we? <laughs> this tractor and trailer. Alright. Bit of a ride here. Whoa. So we'll go down, and uh, this is where having, you know, several hundred thousand liters of silage comes in handy. We'll go down to the animal farm and grab a trailer load, and then we'll split it between those two up there. That should give that uh, grass bales a lots of time to ferment. In fact, we'll have to hope it all fits, because I don't know that I can afford to buy a uh, 
an under undergrounder bunker sunker thinger there for that farm as well. So we might end up dragging leftovers home. Dude, you missed the entrance. Oh, I meant to use the back one here. Oh, I see. Phew. Good thing it's got it two entrances. <laughs> choice between grass or silage, but I guess not. Is it all silage now? Is that the deal? No, heck no. Still half a million liters of grass in that thing. Good morning. Mainly. Hmm. Two thousand liters a piece doesn't quell their need. Well, we're in the wrong business. All right, this will be a bit of a haul. We're also going to want a uh, a goodly amount of uh, mineral feed. Alright, so here's our giant cornfield. We still haven't reached top speed here. There we go. Yeah, this one doesn't bury itself in the, uh, the red. Drive neutral and reverse. Boy, pretty simple transmission on this tractor. Well, simple from the user's point of view. I'm sure to be able to do that and still do what a tractor does, it's anything but a simple transmission. It's probably insanely complicated compared to your little putt buddy car. Gates are closed. Oh, the robot's in business here. He's doing his thing. Well, it just finished doing its... No, no. There we go. Yeah. Oh, crap. I gotta get out of the way. Robo-readers are on their way here. Jeez, talk about poor timing, eh? Where you go? Robot, where you going, man? Can I get a ride? 
like some kind of weird Roomba, eh? There he goes. Yeah, here we are, walking with robots. <laughs> they all say hi as it goes by. It didn't do anything. Ah, doesn't seem to care I'm here, does it? Oh, I see. Really? Yeah, out comes the little shoot thing there. Huh. Doesn't really seem to have an actual, uh... Oh yeah, it does. You just can't see it. Cool. Oh. It'll close us in here if we're not careful. Alright, well I bet there's next to... Yeah, there's no silage in there now at all. And mineral feed. Well, it doesn't grab that much of it. I guess even cows don't need to eat that much sand. Okay. Yeah, there's the other guy returning to his stall. Boy, they are uh, certainly synchronized, aren't they? Wow, right down to the doors closing at the same time. Cool. Well, open the curtains. I got a load of uh, silage here for you. So. All right, Let's dump about 20k in there. Well, they ended up with 51.5%, uh, instead of uh, 50. Oh, uh, we already fed the dog. I'd stay and play with them this morning, but we've got to go and get uh, another tractor. Boy, it doesn't even put a lump on the floor, right? There he goes. Good stuff. And, uh, spend, uh, oh, I'm going to say a third of the money we have on mineral feed. But. That was, uh, that was well-timed, not because we interrupted the robots, but because they had just taken the last of the silage out of both of those barns, so. There would have been no feeding at the next robot. All the cows would have stood there waiting for their little red friend, and, uh, it wouldn't have happened. Sad, sad days. Sad days. Jeez, man, do something about your field. <laughs> okay. Ooh. That's looking good. Growing weeds. I hate you. You wipe my feet. switch back over to the new Holland for the smaller trailer. Less maintenance and less diesel.
because I don't really want to haul. Another loader down there. Just to move some big bags. We'll use the other system. We'll load them directly into the trailer. Alright. Let's go. We want big old bagos. That is the only way it comes, eh? Well, actually, no, it also comes in, uh, pallets. Yeah, mineral feed, a thousand bucks for a thousand fifty liters. Hmm. Okay. And in big bags, it is... A thousand twenty for a thousand liters or twenty forty for two thousand. Hmm. Hmm? Oh. Never mind, man. Whoa, I was reading that wrong. Yes, please. We'll take, uh. Yeah, we'll take. Uh, you don't have an option to buy them in bunches? Okay, well, that's an interesting way to put it, I suppose. We'll just get our helper in there to load the bags straight into the trailer. So that's going along nicely now. Where are you getting them from? Back there? Okay. How about if I help you along? Still working on the first one. There we go. Like we've uh, there we go. It's now filling another one. Much easier to just rest it on the top of the trailer. There we go. Still working on that one? Good stuff. 
You don't mind if I grab the last one, do you? Okay, 8,400 liters. All right, so we'll drop uh, 4,000 or so at each station and call her good, eh? It does last a fair bit, obviously, compared to the other stuff, or it would have been gone after that robo run as well. Forget it's such a short run from the other farm to the turnoff. I'm used to coming from the other side. Yeah, this guy too, even downhill, goes nowhere near its red line. Hangs in about exactly the same place our other tractor does. Admittedly, on these light hills, it does have to give more RPM because it's got a smaller engine. Alright. Now, I believe we're tipping to the right. So... Well, they did close the door. Really? Freaking robots. <coughs> Yeah, just when you're old, look how special. Man, I can't even close a door. Okay, let's get into a position of tipping the mineral fit. Okay. And let's watch the numbers. Yeah, close enough. Hey, there's the doggo. Hey, buddy. What's she doing? <laughs> oh, man. Messing with the dog. <laughs> uh, oh, well. At least we got one part of the parking lot cleaned up. Okay, let's get this guy over here. Um, well, this door is open too. should keep things going for a bit so now perhaps we can consider Ooh, they've got a full pallet of wool nice um starting to put some canola down Oh, 
although in all honesty, I think we're probably pretty much at the end of the episode, aren't we? Whoops. Once again, switch tractors, because it's what I do. Oh, this trailer's looking a little uh, crusty as well, isn't it? <laughs> I could probably use a bit of a treat. Ah. All right. Percent fert and seventy-eight percent. Okay. Let's see what we can do about that. Oop. Fill her up. There we go. We will, however, be changing that to. Uh, that Wow look at our sun flowers <laughs> very good now is our little unit over here doing it's doing diddly oh no it's doing cotton fiber Oh, let's see. So probably need to bring another couple of uh, bins of cotton over if there's any ready. Indeed. All right, are you full now? Mm -hmm. Almost. Let's hit you once more. seem to want to pick up on the fact that there's lots here. Are they too far back? Yep, there we go. Oh, sure, you fit through there. No problem. Lovely. All right. A seating we shall go. Yeah, we'll start with the headland across the top, and then we're going to go down the side. So, 
Let you get you into your big old normal self here. With that, my friends, we're going to call it an episode. So, do hope you enjoyed. If you did, please uh, do remember to hit that like button. It really helps out a bunch. Look forward to your comments. Make sure you leave some. Till next time, take care of each other. And ciao for now. Ooh, look at that. Perfect pH. Perfect nitrogen. Ooh, I'm good.